natural enemies that you may have heard about are these forty flies, these parasitoids. So there's a fly here getting ready to attack a fire ant. And what the fly does is it injects an egg into the body of the fire ant, and then that egg hatches into a larva, which then migrates up into the head, and that fly completes its development inside the head by eating the tissue of the head of the fire ant. Um, so you can imagine that fire ant workers, when they're out collecting food, they see these flies, they're scared to death. They don't want anything to do with them. So they'll go back in the nest. And so in South America, there have been lots of studies where the fire ants will come out for foraging, the flies will show up, and the, and the ants will disappear. They'll go underground. Because they're, they're deathly afraid of these things. Because it can literally kill them in a pretty gruesome way. So they're called anti-capitating flies because once the larva completes its development in the head, it's eaten all the tissue that basically holds the head on. And everything in the head, and the head just falls off. Okay, and then out of that head emerges a new fly. All right.